Yes, like you rightly said, we are here to celebrate uh, the birth of Mary, right? The legions are here to celebrate Mary. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so, so a quick one. I want to ask you a quick one. Uh, in the Bible, this statement was made. Hail Mary, Mother of God, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Who made this statement and on what occasion was this statement made? Yeah, actually it was um, um, Angel, Angel Gabriel, definitely Angel Gabriel made the statement. Elizabeth also um, also um, um, accredited to the statement alongside in verse of um, Luke 1, 38 or so. Well, Mother Mary, she's actually the second Eve that triumphed the same temptation, the first Eve fell into by allowing herself for God to use Mother Mary to redeem mankind back to himself. We know that the role she played in the divine project of God for God himself to actually um, redeem the whole world again for himself. Um, when the angel Gabriel came um, to give Mary the news of the birth of the son, um, he made that statement, hailing Mary as the queen of the world, um, giving her the instruction to take care of the child. Okay. And then of course the completion of that prayer is when she went to visit her cousin Elizabeth and her cousin Elizabeth also told her through the unction of the Holy Spirit that she was going to bear a child and she would be respected and blessed among all women. Yes. Thank you. Mary had a sister. The sister had a son. The son, the cousin to Jesus. Who was that? Elizabeth John the Baptist. Are you sure? Yes, I am. Sure. Yes. Thank you, Kelly, for coming on board of First Act Online. Mind you, this is son of the soil. We are here together, repping a All right. You have a nice. Wait for you guys next year, man. Be where, man. Come in next. Uh, Mary's son. The son is Jesus. Mary's son. Yeah. I will not tell you the answer, but by the. Uh, that would be John the Baptist. All right. Thank you very much for coming on our red carpet. Okay. Have a nice day.